I'm off every Monday, and it's one of the perks of working in healthcare. Since we work such long days, you usually get an extra day or two compared to everyone else. So while everyone's in the office, the roads are mine. My name is Joe. I am the owner of a 981 Cayman and I live in San Diego, California. When you're younger, your plans don't always make sense. I recall making a plan when I was around nine or 10 years old. All I wanted was a job that got me out at 3 p.m. so I could watch some cartoons and enough money to buy that Porsche Turbo from Bad Boys. Somewhere along the line, we get older and we start to forget what happiness was and how simple it can be. In my early 30s, I felt like I wasn't being practical enough. And I could hear my parents' voice in my head uh, telling me that these two-door cars that I was getting were not practical and they served no utility in the household, etc., etc. Um, so I moved forward and traded my car in and got a Toyota 4Runner. And now, before everyone jumps on me, car enthusiasts definitely can love a 4Runner and still be car enthusiasts. But for me, it represented something a little sad, like the dying of a dream that I held on to since I was a little kid. Uh, I was riding with my fiance one day and she turns to me and says, you look like you're very unhappy when you're driving this car. She, she went on to explain what she meant. Uh, she remembered how happy I was driving the RSX when we first met. After she said it, I kept thinking about it over and over. 2020, the pandemic hit, followed quickly by the chip crisis. Car prices skyrocketed because cars like mine, the 4Runner, were not readily available. So being the curious person that I was, I checked around to see how much my car would be worth. The offer for my 4Runner was several thousand dollars more than I had paid for it to begin with. And this is with five years and 50,000 miles on the car. So I jumped at the chance. I immediately moved forward with the offer. And this is without even knowing what car I was going to replace it with. But at the time, uh, as I was browsing through the internet, on some of the car sites, I stumbled upon this Guards Red Porsche Cayman uh, 2014, and I remember the mileage being super low. It was about 12,000 miles on the odometer. The deal was almost perfect. It was too good to be true. Uh, the pricing matched up exactly so I could come in and buy the car cash. Each and every Porsche is infused with the same DNA they keep a thread of similarity in every single car since the very start. The things like mechanical feel, analog, uh, sound are very important to Porsche and you can tell the moment you start driving the car. Having a purpose-built car coming from an SUV was a huge shift for me. I've driven everything from uh, late 60s uh, Porsche 912 to something like a GT3. Um, and I can tell you the Porsche DNA is infused in each and every single one of the models. It's actually something to behold because each one will be unique, but they all have that same DNA in every single one of them. That's something really special in this day and age. Uh, a lot of the auto industry is moving towards purpose-built cars, practical cars that get you from point A to point B, uh, save money, everything besides the actual enjoyment of the drive itself. And I know I might sound like a dinosaur, but uh, the analog feel is always going to be a top priority for me. The Porsche came in with the 2.7 liter uh, naturally aspirated engine 
is fast enough, but the features I love the most about the car is the handling. Porsche's mid-engine platform offers a balance that I could never achieve with my cars before, even lowering them and switching out to different tires. Uh, having Porsche engineers build that into the car gives you so much enjoyment as you're taking some of the curves. The car feels planted at all times. You have such a confidence in the car, especially if you get high quality tires for it. That thing is sticking to the pavement. I guess what I'm saying is happiness still can be as simple as it was back then. And I found out through trial and error and over time that happiness for me is ripping through a canyon road with a mid-engine Porsche engine roaring in the back on a Monday morning.